is Table Talk, where we discuss your topics that you send in using the hashtag Table Talk or on our subreddit, r slash sourcefed. I'm Meg Turney. I'm Steve Zaragoza. I'm Philip DeFranco. Let's start it. <laughs> Good what song, does your bro. bracelet say? It's a, the name of a soldier that was killed uh, overseas. They're called Hero Bracelets, and when you buy them, they donate money to charities that help that's soldiers awesome. and their family. I didn't know that was a yeah. thing. I thought that was like, don't give me penicillin or I'll die. <laughs> I thought that's what that was. So. Please clear my browser history. Uh, no, and actually, I just um, did a video, and I selected a new soldier. I've been wearing um, Master Sergeant Hornbeck's name for since I was a senior in high school. Yeah. So now uh, wow. there's a soldier that just deployed to Afghanistan, so I just ordered a bracelet with his name on That's it. That's awesome. You should just thing. keep wearing them. Like, you can't get rid of that guy. Well, I'm not you had him get with you rid since of high him, school. But I mean, like, uh, while this uh, soldier's overseas, I'll wear his name every day. So he's in my thoughts, too. That makes sense. Yay! All right. At Spuddy and Stark says, if you could go back in time and change one moment in history, what would you do? Hmm. Is anybody not going to say Hitler? Well, there's been the conversation, right? It would, if you went back, would you kill baby Hitler? Because you're still technically killing a baby, and also you don't have the knowledge if someone else would be in his position, and would they be far right. worse? That's or, the thing. Uh, you never yeah. know. Although it would be hard to be worse than Hitler. It's. I mean, there have been a lot of people who are worse than Hitler. <laughs> I just Pol Pot, think... I would uh, say um, Stalin. All right. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, maybe worse. Still, it's Hitler. Yeah. That's a thing, right? Yeah, Hitler's, yeah, Hitler's kind Hitler's of known like, as like the ultimate evil. He's like the pretty evil. boy of like oh, evil. The people. pretty he's the boy poster boy of yeah, evil. Yeah. Pretty, of evil. Yeah. It's still, it's still. He's also pretty. He's so bad <laughs> that even after all this time, if you have that mustache, it's like. Ooh. Well, I like know, when, remember still when can't. Michael Jordan tried to bring it back, oh. and we we're like, no, 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 no. Sorry, Jordan. We, Wait, uh, but when he did that, was he on the Wizards? Because that was a different Michael Jordan. <laughs> this was like a Hanes commercial. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, really? Yeah, <laughs> he's in ballsy. Somewhere he's like on the airplane. And oh, then the okay. guy's like, look, no bacon collar. And he yeah. full on has a Did he also do that? Check out these underwears! <laughs> oh, did he also no. do that in the car? <laughs> <laughs> Those <laughs> over there! <laughs> <laughs> I like that you try and make it like it's an action, like you didn't just Zeke Heil in the middle No, he of did. Commercial. He was pointing at the underwear over there. <laughs> Michael Jordan, secret uh, Nazi. This is a thing, though. <laughs> that should be a thing. <laughs> is that Benjamin Franklin, time traveler, <laughs> offshoot? Michael, Michael Jordan, Jordan, secret Nazi. <laughs> secret Nazi. Uh, well, the thing is, is... Um, that was the movie he passed on when he did <laughs> Space Jam. Yeah, exactly. Space Jam, secret Nazi. <laughs> uh, uh, what, what would you change? Well, I, I don't know. know. The thing is, is like... Um, where we are now as a society, as a people, as as earthlings, um, I don't know. We're in a place where earthlings. we've learned everything from. Well, we share this earth. We're earthlings. Uh, we've learned everything we've learned. Everything we are now is due to the things that have happened in our history. Yeah, in our past. I would. I would punch Thomas Edison in the face so hard he went into a coma. <laughs> so that way we could have gotten uh, Nikola Tesla. Nikola Tesla doing awesome bullshit. Yeah. Oh, awesome right. bullshit. Awesome that, bullshit. <laughs> Even stuff I like, Michael like it's Jordan's bullshit. Secret you just Nazi, want Tesla. Tesla, awesome bullshit. You want Tesla to have more of the glory than the other guy. Well, not even more of the glory, just more of like, if if he didn't have to like near the end like have to fight for stuff and people take his shit, yeah. I feel like we would have we would have advanced yeah. far more. I mean, yeah. the guy was doing shit that like, like still today is like amazing. Yeah, it's just amazing. It's true, it's true. Uh, right. Why haven't they made the cool Tesla movie? Where's that movie? I want Chris is, Nolan is on the it. Is the movie just him getting fucked and then he dies penilessly? Like, hey, uh, there movie? have been more depressing movies. Have you ever seen Fried Green Tomatoes? That I, so I wait a second. That. I love that movie. Yeah. It's a good well, movie. Well. Don't put your arm so close to the train. Um, <laughs> that's the thing in the movie. Also, all, don't all steal two a... of you forty-year-olds that have seen <laughs> Fried Green Tomatoes. I would, I would say <laughs> spoiler <laughs> alert, but people that say spoiler alert on old movies are. Yeah, well, exactly. and it's not its not a big part of the movie. Also, don't take a woman's parking spot if she's going through a bad day. She'll fuck you up. Okay. Oh, no. I just realized we did this. Yeah. And then this morning on the Reddit, I saw that we had a, 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 drinking game. a table talk drinking game, which, by the way, a lot of you watch this in the morning. So that's that's kind of worrying <laughs> that you would that's make a true. drinking game. You're yeah. like, I have nothing to do with my day. I know that there are people that listen to it in the car like a podcast, too. <laughs> just so don't do that. Do you lies. Yeah. And it, Fuck and me! With no. all the ones that we've been doing, we've killed three people. Yeah, we just, <laughs> <laughs> uh, if I wait, if I were gonna change it? a moment in history, I would say the library at Alexandria burned down, had a bunch mm. of like um, historical texts. Oh, that's cool! Cause then like there's this movie, this famous Lon Chaney movie called London After Midnight, and everyone's seen the picture, and you know what I'm talking about, right, DJ? And the and <laughs> it it got destroyed and burned and it's the one where he's like holding the lamp and he's got like the creepy teeth and the hat. You'll you'll know what I'm talking about when you see it. But that movie got destroyed and doesn't exist. I would try to bring that back. 
bring one of those back. Why not? Leave all the fucking things that happened alone. You know, the Hitler thing is way too much. It's way too much. <laughs> hey, people who Steve died. Steve Zarago is hey, a secret. Uh, I know, it sucks. people who died. It I'm sucks, sorry it sucked, but, but it's too much of a change. This is the thing, though. It sucks that they died, but they died, and now we're aware of it, and their legacy lives on, and it's a very important thing in our history I, that we that, listen, that changed I agree. people. I don't know I don't if anyone's think ever that been like, the Holocaust. It's a good thing that, that happened. happened. No, so I'm, not, I'm not saying it's a good thing. I'm just saying that there is now, there. there's a bigger awareness, there's a bigger, I, I mean, I don't know, we... We like sympathize a lot I, more with those people and the way they were treated and what happened there. I, it's a fucking awful as, thing. As it Americans. is, but I just I, I disagree because we still had genocide all over the planet yeah. since the Holocaust. Yeah. So yeah. it hasn't really prevented. And as far as like, it like it was a thing that made all people love Jews. Have you like other than the United States? Have you looked at like how people <laughs> view Israel? It's true. You're other right. than the United States, You're right. it's like. Everyone's angry. Everyone. <laughs> we have a uh, Nate Patel who says, "What do you think is the greatest TV theme song of all time?" My answer to that is the only song that is now in my brain because that's what they do: is step by step, day by day. That's so that one's stuck in my head. Uh, well, also but, the well, Fresh Prince. Ahead. The Fresh Prince. Oh, oh come, come on, on. you win. Come on. Well, I'm sorry, you're both wrong because Pokemon has the <laughs> best theme song. I sing it in my car, the extended version, and it's amazing. I think the weird. Al version of the Pokemon. Don't, don't that is, speak to me that's pretty about good. anything that's. Pre- I love Weird Al though. I don't know. If yeah, I, I was gonna I, say. I would you know. be down to it. Oh, but Wait, you haven't heard the Weird Al Pokemon song? No. song? Oh. Uh-huh. It's like it? a polka, isn't it? It's like a. It's like the Pokemon. Well, everything polka. he does is. Well, it's like everything. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I'm doing hip hop. That was like that that What's another good one? Charles in Charge. That I was, was just one? singing Charles in Charge for some Dude, reason. And that's literally all I know is Charles in Charge of our days and our nights. Our nights. Also, uh, I thought it was live. Free from too. China, never met her before. Who care when you drop kick the jacket? Where'd you came for the dog? Is that a song or are you having a stroke? <laughs> well, it's a little of both, actually. Help me! <laughs> well, no, like... Mr. Belvedere. Mr. No, Belvedere. Come on! Oh, wait, what was he, uh, what was Saved by the Bell? When I wake up in the morning and I'm on this other morning and I don't think I'll ever make it on time. I'm at the corner just in time to see the bus fly by. It's all right, because I'll see by the bell. Yeah, it's a classic. 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 When I went through my insomnia phase, that comes on at like 4 a.m. and I'd be like... Yeah. Uh, I think there are so many good There's ones. There's too many DuckTales. Yeah, make, make sure when, when you, because we haven't come up with a, a question of the day yet, but let us know more, because there's just so many. So, There's so many. I can't remember Friends. Friends? Though, I don't think. Does heaven told you life was gonna, gonna be this way? You always do the clap. Even when I'm home alone, I do the clap. You love laughs, D-O-A. My favorite thing to do, this is real, uh, I take Penny and I make her pause do the clap. <laughs> Amazing. Well, <laughs> as a weird cat and lady. She does, I, and this is her defense, and she puts her big snout between her paws, so it's like, meh, meh. She like Subjecting her own your thing. dog. That's her way of just trying to stop. Know, She's she like, said, no. dance for me, monkey, make me laugh. <laughs> I make her dance all the time. Uh, uh, Nikki at Caliber Nick on Twitter says, What is the worst nightmare you ever had, and have you ever had a repetitive dream? Ooh, um, I, really I remember serious. all my dreams every night. I really? Wake up and God. Dreams. So I, if I wake up like, <gasps> I remember uh, two nights ago. It's like the thing is when I wake up in the morning, I'm like, well, it wasn't that scary. But at two in the morning, I had a witnessed a car crash and someone's throat was slit, and they were like, "Mom." And I remember like the fact that they were calling for their mom like creeped me out so bad. Fuck. And I woke up and I was like, "Oh my God." Okay. I'm trying to think. Right. Nightmares like. I'll just be somewhere and there will be a nuke that goes off. For the longest yeah. time, I had like scary nuke dreams. Never like, had a nuke dream. Like, I've that's had a nuke how dream. I was gonna go out. I've yeah. had a tsunami dream. Tsunami I, dreams are the yeah. fucking scariest. So, because like, because I'll just like wake up. Like it'll literally be like Lindsay moved, and like that'll like trigger something in my brain, and it'll be like no <laughs> disasters. And, I'll fall. and but the only like repetitive dream I have, I'm always like. A secret agent, and I'm trying to like save a lady. Oh, that's bad. Right? I'm trying to save a lady, and then at some point, like either she dies or I'm about to die. Oh. I think my brain just has a weird sense of self importance. <laughs> just like I'm, it's me. Do I must you, save the world. What? Do you get to bang her before she dies? No. Never. That's a bummer. I don't have. I don't really have. Any I had a dream last night that Charlie Hinnom and I invented a like a zeppelin, and yeah. I was and my alarm kept going off because I guess I set them like back to back, and I was like. Charlie Hunnam, you really need to work on all of these alarms that keep going off. And then I woke up to my alarm. Did you? 
Did you bang him? I didn't bang him. God, what's up with all these boring dreams? We're not banging what about people. You? Which would you have? We'll see. Other than tsunami dreams. Okay, I I'm used to have tsunami a, before a, I died. I'm banging this chick, and then a tsunami happens. I have many reoccurring dreams, which are very strange and very fucked up. But the one I remember as a child that I haven't had in a very long time, thankfully, is uh, one where I would be stuck in like the Mervins my mom used to take me into when she would go shopping. <laughs> it was a cup. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you guys. It was amazing! <laughs> I was like, ooh. Uh, I don't think it's going to be so awkward the, if it was real. Did the like, mic pick that up? <laughs> Please help the mic pick that up. All right, go, go, go. Well, good to know if I accidentally do fart on the show, you'll both go, ooh. <laughs> ooh, very good. Turning 10 points. Uh, <laughs> Turning 10 <laughs> points. So it's the stream where I'm in the Mervins and uh, there's no one there and it's closed and it's fucking dark and it's creepy and there's a mannequin that's like coming after me and it's like very slow and it's like frightening as fuck, man. Yep. Is the Mervins like a grocery store? Mervins was like no. a big uh, clothing store. Oh, uh, okay. It's like yeah, yeah. Wieners. Does anybody else remember Wieners? That was like a southern <laughs> chain. Okay. It's also a clothing I just, store. My brain like was like a fucking highway of jokes and it was an eight car pile up like before I could say anything. <laughs> That's what it's uh, called when they touch you, right? We got last one. Go to last one. Oh, before you do that, have you guys you guys know about lucid dreaming? Yeah. Yes. I'm so fascinated. I've done so much research. I tried. I used to be able to when I was a teenager, but and now I hear there's these devices that can kind of help you lucid oh. dream. But I don't understand why this isn't a bigger thing. Like it's you can make your own world. But it's very difficult for some people. I have the ability to lucid dream at the end of my dream. So for the last like what seems like the last ten minutes of my dream, I'm able to like manipulate, and then I'm like, oh no, I'm waking up too much. Like don't wake up yeah. too much. Don't wake up too much. But, but see, okay, I heard that you can learn these methods. Yeah, and it's you like keep trying a dream to journal. move. Yeah, like trying to move like just your hand. Yeah, and then like letting that be it, and then like trying to move your arm. I've just always had this idea. Are you I fucked up this table talk. I'm you sorry. Did. So mayday, for Mayday! We've got an empty bowl, sir! We've got an empty bowl! Thanks for joining us, and remember, you can send in bowl <laughs> topics using the hashtag table talk or r slash source that I'm Meg Turney. I'm Philip DeFranco. I'm Steve Zaragoza.